KVK is just around the corner and our opponent is K61. The opposing server has some great players, but will they fight? Our tactic is simple. We will occupy the castles on our server to gain time and empty the minds of enemy collectors. We will wait and see how K61 behaves and strike back if necessary. But who will win this KVK? K-174 or K-61. KVK has started, and the first opponent that came to our server, we immediately occupied with the Dragon Ability Blockade. After we blocked him, Jabber started the first rally against him. Jabber attacked with pure infantry and women plus weakness setup. Robo 13 defended with cavalry spear formation and used a weakness setup. Since Robo 13 only had spear commanders, his cavalry didn't do much damage, and it was a strong win for us. This is how legends are made. I'm cranking up on the throttle, victory is mine. Show you the harder the battle, harder I fight. Robo 13 switched from cavalry spear formation to spear cavalry formation, which made our rally do even more damage. And after our second rally, Robo-13 drew a bubble. A short time later, we saw a player clearing the mines on K-61, and we decided to block him with the Dragon Ability Blockade to start a rally. Jabber attacked with pure infantry and women plus weakness setup. Stauros Darko was a bow player with a solid setup for bows. Since Stauros Darko had a lot of T1 bows in defense, it was pretty even in terms of losses. Robo 13 was back and attacked one of our players. But this time Jabber, our rally leader, was not online, and I tried my luck with a rally against him. This is how legends are made. Like Robo 13 used a random relocation so that our rally hit immediately. I attacked with pure infantry and women plus weakness setup. Robo-13 defended with cavalry spear formation and a spear weakness setup. Despite his cavalry being in front, we did good damage against him, as he mainly has spear commanders. It looked like Robo-13 wanted to lose some troops or just reduce his power, and we started rally after rally on him.
After this rally, we reached his T2 units. It wasn't worth starting any more rallies as T2 units give few points and no merit points. Robo-13 started the KVK with 3.1 billion power. After our rallies on him, he only had 1.9 billion power at the end, so he lost 1.2 billion power through our rallies. The KVK was coming to an end, and we had a good lead that K61 couldn't catch up on the points, and so we won the KVK. Well played, K61.